What's going on? Take this off real quick. It is finally the day that I actually, uh, actually don't. It's been a couple of days now uh, since I've been able to get out. And uh, basically, quarantine is over for me. Uh, actually, quarantine ended for me on the... I don't even know what day it was. I think it was the 12th, 12th or 13th. It's currently Friday. About to go see Murph, buddy Murph, who you guys have all seen before. For the first time in since, I don't know, what, four months, five months, whatever it is now. So yeah, about to go see good old Murph. I've not been to his new place yet, so kind of interested in seeing how that pans out. First day out and about, here we go. So the day that I'm actually filming this, uh, it's the 15th of May. Today's actually the first day of Ohio opening up their patios so people can't like sit inside but they can go to the patios get food and, and drinks and things like that obviously you know keeping their distance from each other but honestly it's kind of funny right now because the last few days or so has been consistently raining and it's funny to me because <laughs> I think people are so desperate today just to go out and converse with other people in public that they don't even care like if it's raining or if it's wet they're just like hey, let's just let's do it screw it so i think it just it's funny to see the differences between ohio and germany a little bit just because i think oh at least in germany people are a little bit more cautious and self-conscious about it so they don't really want to mess with things too much but then you have uh, americans who just are i don't know i guess we must be just like naturally conversive culture over here because it's just people are they just want to get out they just want to go and do something so interesting here we are Fancy. Let me in. Let me in. Oh. Hey! hey. Elbows. 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 <laughs> well, welcome to the house. Oh! Oh! No. Wow! Oh! No. Thank you. Not a lot of people think to take their shoes off when they come in. I know the rules, you old house. Well, yeah. yeah let's go. Oh! Shit. <laughs> oh. What do you say? My God. Oh. I know, right? This motherfucker running in 59. I know, right? So that is actually a wood-burning fireplace. That actually works. When Connor bought the house, he had to get the chute replaced. The part that I peek out about that I still love is this. That's... That Into a closet. Fancy. Part of ball we have to play that. It's awesome. <gasps> it's basically beer pond butt putting. This house is full <laughs> of secrets. I know, right? So I don't remember when the house was built, but this is the original part of the house. Yeah. And then as you can see for the different the different wood, this is the addition they put on to it. This is the kitchen area. It's like the Washington Monument, you know what know, the difference right? is. Seriously. <laughs> so this is, yeah. This is Good the, God! This is the kitchen area. This is our coffee machine. I love this thing. Like, <laughs> grinds up the coffee per, like, whatever it's making. Yeah, two ovens. This is a heat a warming drawer. This is the reason why I came. Yeah, right? <laughs> there it is. Woo. We gotta get some more materials, but yeah. Still. Connor got that for free. Free? Yeah, he did the he did a podcast for I guess Jimmy Buffett's a big uh, a big Black Box fan. Lucky son of a gun. Yeah. So this is the Oh. Yeah. The fountain used to work. Connor's having a problem with it, but yeah, this is the porch and we've all been having a problem with the fountain of youth. I know, I right? Exactly. And this is the yard, fire pit. <laughs> Self-destruct. I know, right? It's 30 seconds. This is the garage. We'll get, we'll get that way in a second because that's oh. the, the gym is done in there. Besides, of course, the furniture, this all came with that. Like the house is already done like this. I think about planning a little for, they left this year. I think about planning some of these just for fun as a goof. Sage. Yeah. Rosemary, parsley. She's the I know. by the way. <laughs> so he was originally thinking about getting rid of the fountain. I was like, you need to keep it. And so when it's working, it's awesome. But we, it just keeps going off and up. So apparently it's run on an app. So yeah. when Connor tries to turn turn it off and then turn it back on, it out it shorts the outlet. So it just never works. I say just stop your fussing. <laughs> you put a ranch <laughs> fountain in there. Jesus. <laughs> <Not> that <bad>. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So this is the dining room area. Oh, amazing. This is awesome, dude. Shame this is crack. Life. Football players. This is crack. I know you guys. Yeah. Are you yeah, turn it on? You turn it's it on, on right here. Oh, oh, oh boy. Oh, it might be dead. It's dead. <laughs> yeah. What were you doing last that night? That thing is awesome. No, that thing is awesome. So this is the laundry room. Connor actually had to get this all redone. So like this, look at this here, the flooring. It's the nicest. Get this, whatever you call this, that's built in. 
you had to get this all built in that wasn't originally here. This so. is the nicest room. Is that all right? Look at the way. <laughs> That's so nice. You can, you can know, do your can, laundry and then you can eat, eat your snacks. Eat the pods. Eat you know, the pods. Yeah. This is the half bath, bathroom in down. It's the only one down here, fortunately. Ooh. This is a really weird, just a little utility room. And obviously there's our router, there's our internet. Connor also had, while he was doing this, he built in this closet that we kind of use as a miscellaneous coat and some book bags. Ooh. So he built that and then he also built this. Hey, look yeah. at that. So me and Connor's shoes. And this is the car room pretty much. So that is a gas fireplace that works by remote. So you could turn that on. This is one of two wine fridges that they had put in here. So they had wine fridges put in here. Pretty much then the other cool little thing is they left like a, a small, I haven't used it yet, but they left a small dishwasher for like just some little odds and ends here. And it's like a little, they call this like a champagne bar or something. I don't know what they call it, but something like that. That's why I want to come back. <laughs> That's the one full of water, and the one in the box is full of vodka. Oh yeah, nothing more painy than that, there, eh? <laughs> Before you guys say anything, I had my mask on. I'm keeping my distance, so stop it. <laughs> stop it. I know what you guys think, especially right. you Germans. This is his office. Yeah. So obviously he's got some. Obviously he's got a he's lot got of work done here. Some keepsakes, some stuff, and yeah, this is the this is the main office, his office. So this door, as well as that door, open out into the front. So like. Oh my god. And they god. got they put the screens too. So like the problem is they're kind of a nightmare to close. Right? So I don't know what you want to do now. You want to go upstairs or you want to go to the garage? Let's go upstairs. All right. This one. Well, the first, the first thing you'll see is my office. It's somewhat clean, but shocker, it's organizing, so there's still some mess in some areas. I don't understand, but I guess these are supposed to be some really special lights that, like, you can't touch with your hands or something stupid like that. Is weird, but oh. they're really, really nice. Food light. I know, right? <laughs> this is my office. <gasps> oh my god! I know, right? This is my dad's old desk. My yeah. dad just put up those, whatever you call those, the. Oh, look at you, yeah. look at all. And then we just set up this too, or my little collage. Oh my so my God. newspaper and goalie and all that stuff. The fun part that I like, so the former owner had a little girl. Mm -hmm. This used to be a little girl's room. So that's why this is a closet. So I also keep my suits and ties in here. And my nice dress shoes. Can't have any pocket squares and lapel pieces and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and this is just like my throwaway jersey area, fun stuff in there. Hell yeah. Yeah, and then that's just a, a closet full of extra stuff all kind of packed away. This is a guest room. Nothing really fancy. It's a nice room. Yeah, right? More of the floating shelves. And this is the other guest room. They left this here. They left some stuff they left because they just didn't want to move. The hell of a guest room. Good. Uh, God, right. those are our neighbors that you're gonna awkwardly be creeping on right now. What's good, bro? <laughs> so my bathroom slash the uh, <laughs> guest bathroom. We good need, God! I know we need to replace this. We don't like this, so he wants to replace that that came with the house. Oh my God! Yeah, toilet paper because you know stocked up for the apocalypse. <laughs> Every time I see it, I have to get some just because people are being fucking douchebags about it. <laughs> Obviously, my room a little messy, but not terrible. Can I just say, last time I've been in Merce room. It's always, you can't take two steps into it. It's always you just a nasty bit. Floor. That's yeah. it, from the fan. there's only yes. one set of lights. Yeah, there's only one set of lights. Yes! <laughs> but usually, last time I'm usually stepping in here, there's usually stuff everywhere, but I'm proud of you, Murph. Thank you, I'm working, I'm working on it. It's hidden <laughs> in my closet right now. I'm working on it. <laughs> yes, there. This literally everything just all got set up recently. I got the... Everything just everywhere, got, got their the, place finally. I got that in there. And I got the Xbox over here, oh. so that way I can, I can set sexy time. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta have the Harley Davidson motorcycle bubble. Take me where daddy sleeps. <laughs> okay, no, it's not <laughs> Connor's room. Oh. That's another fire, gas fireplace that works, so you can have that on. Unfortunately, there was a chandelier up here. He took that out. He's got to find another. Pay your bill! <laughs> closet. Big, big closet. This is a net ridiculous master. Oh, wait till you see the bathroom. Oh. My God. Yeah. And this is the bathroom. So the mirrors they just put in, he's had those replaced. The bathtub, yeah, that's awesome. My man's got a cereal bowl for a damn bath. I teach you the shower. Hey. He also has a bench in it. So he's got a bench. He's got those two shower heads right there for the body. And then he's got <laughs> ones that'll go down like the, the <laughs> <f> <laughs> I know why it takes about an hour to get out of the shower. <laughs> I just wanted to sit down for a while. Leave me alone. So yeah, that's that's the that's the master. Uses the same soap. It's nice. Yeah, he's he's he's, he's organic when he can be. <laughs> so the first fun thing here 
they had a toilet here because this was over the original house. Mostly storage is a lot of unfinished stuff. So this is where you keep with the bodies, huh? I know, right? As you can see, <laughs> I think this was used to be like part of the chimney. What's really kind of cool is this weird, whatever the hell this is, that's really, really old. Yeah, obviously it doesn't really go anywhere. Where do you ship in the coal? I know, right? <laughs> this is his workbench area. Bro, I'm telling you, you can do so much. I know, right? With this. Holy crap. I know. Unfortunately, I'm the same as you, but again, this is his house. And he's here whenever he is, so he's kind of doing what he wants with it, but I would totally like update the shit out of this but that's just me. bro this is you got a nice workbench I know, too right? this came with the house like that was just this came like it's bolted in there yeah it's nice and sturdy Pipes look at that here. you can work on your projects <laughs> and then you take a shower after <laughs> so they left the fridges freezer fridge this is yeah, where this, this is just where i keep my uh obviously yeah right obviously oh yeah it's a mix of a lot of things. By the way, those high noons are awesome. Connor had some hockey players over, so they like they brought some of the the um, healthier beer options. Of course they did. <laughs> not just any meat. You got like veggie patties. Yeah, those are good. I'm not. Uh, those are eight dollars. Looking at me like that. No, <laughs> those are eight dollars for like two patties. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> They're five. <laughs> They're five. Leave me alone. My goalie gear for now, since the rinks aren't open, new pads. Bro, I'm telling you, you put like a mini, I know. mini rink in here well, with the goal. It's the unfinished, the unfinished ceiling part. Someone's gonna lift a stick up and catch something. I thought about making like half of this a putting green. Yeah. So putting a bunch of just like fake turf <laughs> down. Kind of like the idea. I found out this hefty little secret. So there is no heat. In the contraption, man. The only, yeah, the only way it does is, is through the water heater. So the hot water goes through all these pipes and then it goes through the red tubing underneath the floorboards and heats the house because the heat rises. Oh. Apparently, it's really big in here. So maybe you jerk it. I don't know. But I found out when the water heater went down when the first winter came through here that I was freezing and I couldn't figure out why. And it was because they have no, real, they have no heat. The air conditioning is only to circle the air. And then you have to use the wood burning fireplaces to warm the place up if the water heater goes down. So I was taking cold That's... showers and I was still heating the house. It was a nightmare that first winter. It was like it was like one of those polar vortexes of the I thought I was gonna die. That's usually before you know you gotta go out to the forest, chop down your tree, and then yeah, carry the seriously. wood over. Seriously. <laughs> I mean, I respect it, but it's also a huge pain in the butt. Like, you know, this is great, but it's really it's pissing it's me off. It's supposed to be more energy efficient. So of course you go, know, you gotta have the bottle opener here. They've had that. Like, Bro, I have seen so many of these around the house. What the hell's going on? They used to be big. I guess they used to be big entertainers. Hey, how you doing? To the booth wall table I brought from when me and Travis lived together. But other than that, the rest of the stuff you're about to see. Is this can I just say this entrance is ominous? I feel like there's know, right? there should be a tomb somewhere. Right here. <laughs> like somebody died. I know, right? Well, then you come in here, it's not so ominous. Hey! Yeah. Literally everything else in here they have left behind. They did not take with them. So. This is one of the original beams for the house that they obviously use as a decorating here. They left the TV, they left this here, the couch, they left pretty much everything down here they left. The popcorn machine? Yep, yep. They left the speakers, they were already kind of set up. The only thing the guy did, it was like a, it was like a messy divorce. So the guy was pretty much done with the house and the ex-wife was still living here with the kids and she was just trying to get rid of it. Apparently yeah. Connor's like real estate agent says like to live here because it's like, Usually people pass these down to like to their to their offspring, they pass it down oh. to generations. Like a lot of these houses. So like, well, like the people you... next door, my parents talk to them and they're like, yeah, no, my pa their parents owned the house before they did. So these things barely go to market. So well, I saw anyway. the price. I know. I know, right? <laughs> anyway, the guy had ripped and taken the original one of these out. So Connor had to buy a new one of those to get everything to work because they're like, they're worth like over a grand. So the guy just literally, you just see the wires. The guy just grabbed it and just like unplugged it and then just took it left with it. Ah! A lot of the stuff they had and they, they just left, like they didn't want to move it. She was just like, you can, you can keep it, so. Yeah! I know, right? Yeah, they actually had that too. They left that here. It's, like, no. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy. It's like they were fans. Some personal fans. Game pucks. I remember that one. Hope you guys enjoy the Cribs tour. All right, if you guys don't know, Tyler's brother is Connor Murphy, is starting defenseman for the Chicago Blackhawks. Go off. Thank you, Tyler. Of course, you're kind of biased. <laughs> nope! <laughs> nope! Part time he lives out here, and then he, Goes back and forth between here and Chicago. Shy town. <laughs> yeah. All the reason why I know Murph is because of his father, right? <laughs> kind of. Go fathers. Go fathers. San Diego fathers. <laughs> Murphs get drunk. <laughs> I have lines. 
So we have Coronas. I've had enough salt. Uh, and then there's the, so there's the tequila. So I have made with just the mix, the tequila. We've done a little bit of orange juice and a little bit of lime. And then we've actually thrown in a little bit of rum. And it was pretty solid. If you want, we can run and go get triple sec, but I have so far never had a triple sec and you cannot taste the difference. So it's pretty solid. So it's up to you. It's up to you what you want to do. Okay. You want to taste the difference? Then you're good. Well, let's just do this. Because yeah. one, one's not going to kill us. So we can do one. Yeah. And if we find that we want it different, then we can run. Because Giant Eagle is not very far from me. Trust me, you're going to want to report this. This Margaritaville thing, dude, is like, I mean, you saw it. The, the, the videos I posted, it's such a life changer. Yes. We need more ICT to finish on that one. Before I can move on to the other one. There we go. You don't mind it like smoothie kind of, right? Like the ice blended? You like that or do you like the ice chopped here? It's kind of smoothie. Okay, so good. perfect, because that's what it makes, and I don't know how to make the other way. So, <laughs> I mean, we can test it. Do you like that shit chunky, or you like that shit kind of a diarrhea kind of <laughs> taste? No? All right. Not that aggressive. <laughs> that's what she said. Hey. Hey. Right. Yeah, I don't remember putting in that much tequila, but if that's what they that's what they call for, it's what they call for. I'm not gonna question them. Yeah, it's like half tequila, half margarita mix. <laughs> <laughs> do you want me to do the concoction last day with a little bit of rum or do you want to keep it with this? Yeah, add some rum to it, why not? Add some rum? Yeah. Okay. Let me put about I think half the wine in there. Sure. Sounds about white. My hands are clean. <laughs> Guess we're gonna find out, huh? All right. Some food porn shit. That's <laughs> good. Like food ASMR. <laughs> All right. About to get a bunch of comments now. <laughs> Merv has nice fingers. I don't think so. They're all fucking. <laughs> yeah, I've had some weird comments before. People are like, man, I'd love to see your guys' feet. I'm like, yeah, all right. And, Holy. Uh, <laughs> and uh, block. I'm sure they do that just for that reason. You know what I mean? dicks. <laughs> nice toes there. <laughs> yeah, the old <holes> are. <laughs> Captain Morgan, because we can. That That's smells it. good there. So watch this. Here comes a money shot. There we uh, go. Well, there's one, there's this money shot. You push this and just. There's the outlet. <gasps> oh my god. Yeah. Olay, bitch. <laughs> Yay. Oh. Cheers, you dumb bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Being the new power bottoms. <laughs> oh, yeah. You don't taste the alcohol in that. <laughs> Bert! Happy social distancing. We've met. Yay! Margaritas. Happy birthday. Late birthday. Ah, shit. Now the world. That's a bad joke. <laughs> to the beat of this one drum. Stay safe, y'all. And stay interesting. <laughs>